crime is out of control across America. Let's take a look at one day in Indianapolis, Indiana. In fact, not one day, but just seven hours. At 7.50 p.m., officers responded to a shots fired report on the city's west side. A person was found with gunshot wounds in critical condition. At 10.30 p.m., officers responded to a shots fired call in downtown Indy and found a person shot awake and breathing. At 11.20 p.m., police found two men shot in the city's north side. One died at the scene, the other was taken to the hospital in critical condition. Around midnight, officers responded to Eskenazi Hospital and found a person with multiple gunshot wounds. Two hours later, police responded to a call of a person shot on the city's northwest side. Around 3 a.m., officers patrolling the city's northeast side heard gunshots and found a man in an apartment parking lot pronounced dead at the scene. Another man was found a few blocks away with a gunshot wound and taken to the hospital. Police believe these last two may be connected. Eight people shot, two killed in seven hours in Indianapolis. According to police reports, homicides are down 17% from last year and the non-fatal shootings are down 13%. If these seven hours are any indication of what shootings are like in Indy, that 17% reduction doesn't make anyone feel safer.